In Division Three, the Crusaders took a trip down to San Antonio for their toughest test yet. Last year, the Crusaders took down Trinity to end the Tigers' undefeated season in the first round en route to a UMHB national championship. Today, the Crusaders entered enemy territory as the underdogs. And you bet that number three next to UMHB provided some added incentive to hand Trinity another postseason loss in the first half. Kyle King got to work to make that happen. He drops back and finds number seven for six. KJ Miller breaks a tackle and he's in for the score as UMHB takes a 10 to nothing lead into the half. Third quarter now. We go. Crusaders up 17 to nothing, but Trinity generating some momentum. Tucker Horn pumps once and he's looking deep. Cole Minago is wide open to get the Tigers on the board 17 to 7. But the UMHB offense, they find their stride in the second half. King throwing short right here for Brandon Jordan, one of his favorite targets all year long. A stiff arm and he is gone down the sideline. You see that side judge right there backpedaling? Well, he didn't see me. He absolutely barrels into me. Touchdown, UMHB, but we still got to get the shot. Fast forward to the fourth quarter. Trinity, they clawed their way back. Down 14 now. It's Horn to Matthew Kavesevich fighting his way into the end zone right here as the Tigers pull within just one score. And they get one final drive to do it to find the end zone. And it was the UMHB defense that stepped up in the end. Horn looking for anything downfield. But Dorian Pittman, the freshman, chasing him down the entire play. And that's the game. As time expires, UMHB moves on to the quarterfinals with a special group of players that are definitely not done yet. Uh, by and large, um, the leadership of this team, the love that these seniors have, that they know that their time is winding down. There's only three weeks left. That's the most we can have together. Uh, they're going to do everything in their power to keep it and make it three weeks.